A breast reduction is a very common procedure that we do here. It uh, is usually done for ladies that have problems with large breasts that are causing back pain, neck pain, and interfering just with their daily life. For that reason, I see a lot of people that say they wish they had the operation done years earlier, and it's an operation that I know when I see the patients after the operation that they're going to be happy. It does change their lives. It makes it easier for them to, to just do normal everyday activities. They go to the gym. Things that other ladies think is uh, normal, our ladies with really large breasts can find to be really difficult. The, I see a, a variety of different sizes and different ages. Some of the uh, breasts we see are H cup and above, uh, and they normally, when we get them down to somewhere around the C cup in size, uh, it makes a really big difference to their life. As part of the breast reduction, there is always a lift associated with the, with the reduction, which means that the nipple is lifted into a higher position, which makes the breast look a lot nicer. The operation itself lasts, usually takes about three hours and is done often as a day case. Uh, we like to do them in the morning so that later in the afternoon the patients can go home and don't have to stay in hospital overnight. The operation isn't painful and uh, there's most patients are quite comfortable in the bra after the procedure and don't need a lot of painkillers in, the, in the, the days following the surgery. The benefits of the procedure is that clothes fit better, you've got a bigger range of clothes to, to pick from, uh, you're more comfortable, you're more active. Ladies have breast reductions often lose quite a bit of weight after the procedure because they become more active than they were before. And uh, people sleep better and the neck and back pain is often a lot better after the procedure. Breast reductions do attract an item number, which means you do get some money back from Medicare towards both the procedure and if you have hospital insurance, have uh, the hospital uh, uh, costs often covered by the insurer. Your next step is to come for a consultation. I'm happy to go through the procedure with you at length. Um, we will do some examination, we'll show you what sort of results you can achieve and we'll show you some before and after photos of other patients that have had the procedure.